Hey guys, it's your girl Tahita with Beauty and the Kinks. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm just doing an everyday go-to look for you. So if you're interested in finding out how I created this light makeup look, just stay tuned. So I've already done my brows and primed my lids. I'm just using a brown shade in my crease and a little bit above my crease as my transition shade. Then I go into the lid with a tan color. Um, this is from the Michelle Phan palette. I will leave all the information below, but I was super surprised that this was that pigmented and that bright. Um, but I just blended that all out with the fluffy brush. So I did build up some of the brown color a bit, um, just because as I said, I didn't expect for that tan color to be so bright and that pigmented. Um, after blending that all out, I did take a shimmery color highlight in my inner tear duct area just to open up my eyes a bit. And of course I blended that all in. Now I'm just using an angled brush with the brown shade that I used and I'm just taking that into my upper and lower lash line. And of course I added some falsies. I'm just taking some mascara to my lower lash line. Onto the face. So I'm using Ulta's foundation stick and this has built-in primer so I didn't prime my face. I'm just buffing that all out. Just making sure everything looks seamless by blending with a damp beauty blender. I'm just adding some concealer to my highlight areas, just making it a little bit lighter on the higher points of my face. adding a darker concealer on the areas that I would like to contour. So the hollows of my cheek, my nose, and right above or on my forehead. Of course, I am doing some intense blending with the Beauty Blender just to make sure everything is completely blended out. Took some setting powder and I set the highlight areas and now I'm just adding some powder to the contour areas. And of course I'm just buffing that all out with a powder brush. As you can see I'm adding highlighter at this point. Now I'm just lining my lips with NYX Mahogany Lip Liner. Um, I think for the last three videos I've been doing this lip look. I absolutely love this lip liner. 
um, and then pairing it with a nude or lighter color um, for spring. I'm just adding some blush to finish off the look. And that's it guys, that was my everyday go-to look. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Of course, if you have any questions, leave them below. Thanks again for watching, bye guys.